Uh, so we are taking a look at a day that is starting out really nice looking, much like what we had yesterday to start in terms of the way it looks. But today's going to feel a little different. Right now, clear skies, 80 degrees. Uh, we've got the relative humidity at 59%. We are backing up the radar to show you what moved through yesterday. So we started to see these thunderstorms firing up in the early afternoon. Uh, we watched some move through, racing through, dropping some heavy rain, lots of lightning strikes, of course. And so we do have some storm reports out there up to ping pong ball sized hail down trees and wires uh, definitely a tree on a house in some areas so we had we had some problems with these systems right it didn't just move through with no consequence we also picked up quite a bit of rainfall for some places in Inglewood Cliffs 1.4 inches uh, Great Neck 1.2 we also in Syosset picked up nearly two and a half inches of rain that is the estimated rainfall from these systems and again they were fairly fast moving but really packed a punch. So want to show you where we are as far as our heat wave is concerned. Remember, a heat wave is three consecutive days where we get a high temperature of 90 degrees or well, higher. So we were at 90 degrees on Tuesday, 95 on Wednesday, yesterday, 92 degrees. Today we're expecting a high of 93. And then the weekend looks to be even hotter. 95 for Saturday, 97 for Sunday, and then another 90 degree day for Monday. And then even beyond that, temps fall out of the 90s, but not by much. So we are still in the thick of things. Here is the setup for us right now. Cold front move through. What we're dealing with uh, today is basically some calmer conditions. We are tapping in to a slightly drier air mass so it won't be as humid. We do have a chance for some showers or thunderstorms today. It's not as significant as what we had yesterday, so we don't expect it to pack that same punch. Still, we could see some significant downpours and maybe some isolated damaging winds. So, you know, we just keep that in mind. We turn on your futurecast. Now, here is the updated uh, futurecast. This one is showing some activity here in our northwest suburbs at about 5 p.m. And then sort of moving through, losing its steam a little bit, but you can see not as widespread and a little bit farther north. This is what it looks like today versus yesterday when we saw a lot of activity in New Jersey, New York, and Long Island. So we go through your Saturday, slight chance of showers. We head into your Sunday. Again, could see some shower or thunderstorm activity, but really the big story on Sunday is going to be about that heat. Today it's hot, but not as humid. A stray shower or thunderstorm is possible, and you are looking at your seven-day right there. With that, I'll send it back to you, Cindy. Thank you so much.